。呃，当然艺术确实会跟特定的意识形态有关联，但是艺术它又是跟着社会的变化和发展而出现新的趋势。We understand art has to connect with idealism. However, it is also transformed through the stages of social de development. So, I really want to talk about this exhibition, to talk about the changes that have happened in the 20th century in Chinese art. So, I would like, I would very much like to talk with you um, into the 21st century, what kind of change and transformation in Chinese artwork? Then, it is the 20th century. 之所以我们这个展览在中现在这个展览会取名为“都市，都市之中啊”，啊，就不得挺闹。我想这确实是非常符合中国呃进入二十一世纪以后的社会与艺术的关系。呃、uh, ，That's why we pick the theme metro metropolis、uh, as this exhibition's、um, focus and theme because it totally reflect the social and the、uh, urban change in China。嗯，因为中国的社会在九十年代的市场经济啊。<咳>这个嗯，发展进入到二十一世纪的时候，应该说进入了更加全面的啊这样一种呃社会的发展。From the development at the beginning of nineties all the way into the twenty first century, we will say the trans transformation and openness being trans being、uh, more overall and complete. 呃，所以这个都市化就成为最明显的一个中国社会发展的表征。Actually, we will be able to say urbanization is a clear symbol for the development. 呃，在我个人看来，我想都市化可能会带来三个呃方面，就是就是对人的精神的啊一种影响力。I would say urbanization has three major impacts on people o u on human spirit。一个是客观的这种视觉景象发生了变化。呃、uh, ，we would say the objective、uh, visual effects。Has been changed. 嗯，就像我们居住在北京的人一样，我们经常会发现，只要隔一段时间不到另外一个地区，北京的另外一个城区去，就会觉得那里都变得陌生了。Even for us, the local Beijing residents, if we did not go to certain district for a while, just several months, the whole district has been changed. 嗯，中国的传统的艺术观念啊，是希望离开城市走向乡村啊，所以中国有很多艺术作品都是描绘乡村的农民。但是到了二十一世纪以后的话，啊，艺术家更多回到了自己的生活的空间里面，也就是在都市之中。Actually, for the traditional Chinese art,、uh, most of the artists they want to、um, get out of the city and get into the rural area and describe or to express the rural and the country、uh, landscape or、uh, community. However, in the twenty-first century,、um, the artist has changed. They got back into their own living space, which is which are the cities. To Create their pieces. 嗯，第二个对艺术家有作用的就是，由于都市化的进程，它带来了啊，人与人、人与社会之间的一种新的关系。Ah, because of urbanization, so it brought into a new stage for the different relationship between people and people, and also people and society. 那么，在这个时候，艺术家的作品中就出现了一种。自我的啊，双重表述。呃、uh, ，we can call this is a a double double sided self expression。呃，因为艺术家会一作为一个个体啊，他会经常觉得自己淹没在一个都市的发展之中。呃、uh, ，sometimes as an individual, a lot of artists feel they were trapped or flooded by the urbanization process。都市的建筑的发展就像巨大的浪潮一样，会把人哈、啊、彻底的淹没。The constructions in the urban area sometimes just bury you or trap you deeply. 呃，但是呢，艺术家又试图用自己的眼光去带动观众去看这个都市的发展。At the same time, the artists will try their best to use to through go through their own uh, uh their own way to um inspire the audience to understand the urbanization process. 呃，所以他在作品中要顽强的表现出他还在这个都市里。So suddenly, even they feel trapped or they feel flooded by the feeling, they they still want to struggle and express themselves. 呃，所以这个展览的作品和很多中国当代艺术作品，呃，这个艺术家在哪里？哎、呃，实际上是一个非常有意思的，哎、呃，可以值得这个追寻的这个课题。So, so when you view the pieces in Metropolis today. You will be able to feel various artists, their feeling and their reflection. Ah, I think the third thing is the media. 
The third one I want to talk about is the application of the new media. We know the global internet development and information technology um, help China get into a very speedy development. Also expand the artist um, choices to choose their own media. Therefore, uh, today's uh, Chinese artists also choose a lot of different kind of media to produce their art pieces. But at the same time, if we use the new technology too much, it's very possible we will follow the steps of Westerners. 所以很多艺术家就开始思考如何把中国传统的媒介，特别是传统关于媒介的一些观念性的认识，能够转化成他们今天的一种语言。Then a lot of Chinese artists begin to think about, getting into deep thinking, how can they use the traditional Chinese media to bring into the contemporary arts? 所以这样这样一来的话，才能够和我们讲的已经有过的西方。so they will be able to differentiate themselves from the existing Western styles. The three points I made, I think, is a very necessary way to understand contemporary Chinese arts. Because for a long time, this Western culture and Western culture 它是一个很复杂的关系，一方面，呃，有一种啊受西方艺术很强烈影响的这么一个过程，但另外一方面，中国艺术家又需要又又迫切的希望有自己的这种知识系统，有自己作为东方和中国的啊这种传统观念的支